Hey everyone. So in a previous video, I told y'all that I haven't been swimming all summer long. And I can't go swimming because of my medical problems. So I'm going to say it. So I been, um, I've been suffering from having real bad ill infections and and when I'm talking about um no funny Max Max come in <laughs> come in Come up here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come. Zoom. Peanuts. Come here, Ebony. Where come up here? Um, these two fuzzing. Max, come up here. Come up here. He knows how to jump. These two are fuzzing. Um, yeah, Dinsley, come up here. Come up here. Well, I think it's not good for him. Mm. Yeah, but um. Anyway, I've been getting real bad ill infections, and I'm there, and I haven't been seeing it in videos because it's personal, and I don't want to see. It. Everything of my life on YouTube. I want to keep obviously. You want to go outside? Yeah? Look. You want to go outside? You want to go outside? Go, 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 go. And you let me on my tongue. Here. Oh my God. Ow. I hope that gate is closed. I really do. I don't have my glasses on. But I hope. I think it is. I don't know. I will keep it in my eyes. Mm -hmm. But, um, yeah. But I haven't told y'all that um, I've been suffering from it. Because, like, I want to keep that pro. Oh my god! <laughs> they scared the crap out of me. I say, I don't know. Close the. Lock the door. Keep them outside for a couple hours. Minutes. Yeah. So, um. Oh my god! She grabbing! She using the bathroom in the walkway! Oh my god! No, I mean, when my mom and Paul come 
down to go up the steps to come in the house. She used the bathroom in between the steps to come up the house and oh my god. Lazy dog, oh my god. This some lazy dog, but anyway, I haven't like basically discussed it because I've been like I been a little bit discussing it like and everything else but I haven't been I haven't talked about it. I haven't said how bad was it or how not bad was it. So I'm going to say it in this video. So obviously um, with the doctor's names, I'm not going to say, well, some of them I don't know, honestly, the names, but anyway, I'm not going to say it. But, um, first of all, my ears started acting up. I say the word, like, acting up and everything like that. But my ears started acting up when I had a bad accident in when I was nine years old, eight years old, I think eight. But it was in this house when I was upstairs, me, my sister, and our then cousin, Aaliyah, Name Aaliyah, she was on my stepdad's side, that's why I say thin cousin because he's not my stepfather no more. Ebony. Ebony. Okay. Now, and me, my sister, and Aaliyah was upstairs in our room, and we was having, and me and my sister was having a slumber party with her sleepover. So, um, obviously, my sister and Aaliyah was doing stuff was doing um she they were jumping from bed to bed and everything like that obviously I thought I could do that and everything like that so I got my mom upstairs from downhill to let her watch me jump so the bed wasn't the beds wasn't really a really far apart. It was one bed was hell and one bed literally was hell and in between the bed was a mattress. So a bed was hell, a bed was hell. So how I did it, I um did like this. I jump, jump, and then. In mid-air, I got scared and hit my nose on the, like, you know, the edge of the bed. Like, let me show you how my, how the edge of the bed looked. The edge of the bed looked like this, so literally imagine hitting smacking your face. Imagine smacking your face, head, I mean nose, into that. So anyway, my nose after that, my I was of course crying, and of course my nose wasn't bleeding, but my nose turned 
blue, pink. I'm laughing at it now because I'm like saying how stupid was it and how stupid that I, but I wanted to follow behind what my sister was doing <clears throat> and everything like that. So anyway, um, anyway, my nose didn't bleed, but my nose don't multiple colors. It literally don't black, blue, yeah, multiple colors. So, um, anyway, it started next, the next day. My ears just started to clog up and everything like that. So, we saw countless, countless of doctors. We went up to John Hopkins, and yeah, I mean, we saw countless of doctors. They still didn't know what was causing it and why it was like causing it and everything like that. So then, my mom, every once in a while kept on like just doing like this do this her do that her do this her do that her my mom was basically doing that for two years straight <laughs> yeah because it looked it probably it looked it this form I, th I don't really know but um it probably looked at this form and so my mom kept doing like this, do this, do that, do this, do this, do this, do this for two years straight. And then, um, even, and then it, um, ruined my balancing. So I have poor balancing skills now and um everything like that so um so till this day we don't know why till this day we don't know why it's happening while my ears the way it is now what we won't know what happened until I, I forgot what you call it, a CT scan of the um, nose. I don't know what you call it, but I will get that done. I don't know when, but I will get that done. Even though it, the incident happened when I was eight years old or nine years old, I still want to know if something is not right in my nose and everything like that because the way I hit it was so bad and I'm like saying I thought if you hit the nose so hard it will bleed well my nose didn't bleed but it was bruised sold up and bruised for like a few months and everything like that. So, um, I didn't go to the hospital. My mom wanted to take me to the ER that night, but I was really refusing because, you know, I can't stand, I hate hospitals and everything like that. I just been a patient in the hospital two times in my life. One, when I was four months old, I had pneumonia, and the second time when I was ten years old, I fell at, in my OD class, and the second was when I was, when I was ten years old, I fell in my OD class, and I blacked out, 
and everything like that. But anyway, I'm so terrified of hospitals. Yeah, I'm so terrified of hospitals. So my mom, of course, wanted me to wanted to take me to the ER because my nose was turning. My nose turned all different colors, but. I refused because one, I was having fun, and two, I was um, terrified of hospitals. So, um, anyway, my mom said, okay, but if it gets worse, I will monitor it, but if it gets worse, I got to take drink. So, anyway, anyway, why I don't go? Anyway, that story by now, why I don't go swimming. Why I didn't go swimming this summer. Because usually I go swimming every summer. Literally every summer. It's not one summer that I didn't never go swimming. So I did this summer. So I didn't go swimming. Yeah, I didn't go swimming this summer because uh, my air infection's been so bad where I can't even yawn. It's been so bad, and not just that. I had one. I had one bad infection where I had. I'm sorry, that's my pain for my hair, but I had a real bad infection real what hair real it was the size of a cough ball. Yeah. It literally was the size of a cough ball. So for weeks for weeks before that I've been telling my mom I'm having an ill infection, I don't want to go to school because it's been like kind of bothering me. My mom threw it off. She thought that I did, I just was saying that to get out of school by whatever. But until my mom saw a golf ball forming on the side of my face. She was obviously worried, and she, we went to George, Georgetown Hospital, and um, we stayed there. We stayed there for a whole day. Now, I thought that we was only going to stay there for a few hours. We went in at nine. We checked and waited at 9, from 9 in the morning, and then we left, and then they, wow, yeah, I was taking tests forever, and then I, we left at 11 that night, so we have, we watched still 9, 10, 11, 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. We were still for 15 hours. So anyway, of course, we were tired and we were hungry and everything like that. So after that, even now when I get an air infection, when I walk, get an air infection and we don't have nothing for my air infections, I have to, we either have to take another trip up to Georgetown Hospital or for the real deal for like for them to give me a real prescription we have to go to George was through Georgetown Hospital but if we does need some if we does want something for like to take today or tomorrow, we go to um, In and Out.
bad as um, basement floors. So, now, I can't stand hospitals, but I can't stand Georgetown hospitals because Georgetown hospital, but, um, anyway, so, that's why I haven't been swimming because all summer long I've been suffering from real bad ill infections. I have an ill infection now and I'm taking medicine to try to stop it and everything like that. But basically, we've been going back and forth from the, to the Georgetown Hospital, John Hopkins. That's why I haven't, that's why I don't tell y'all this stuff because I don't, I don't want to basically bore y'all on my mess, mess. My medical mystery. It's really a mystery because even when I was in school at Ivy Mount, they still didn't understand why I wasn't walking straight with why I wasn't walking straight without nothing on my ears. And when they put like headphones in my ears, I walked straight like that. So it's still a mystery. Nobody knows why it happened. I think I got to take have a CT scan of my nose because I think I really think something broke through and everything like that. Come on, y'all. Because it's hot outside. It is hot outside. But, um... No. Yeah, but anyway. Max, be nice. I don't know if your heart is, but when Evan went back in the room, Max said, mm hmm. <laughs> do Evan. He always do that. So. Yeah, so I never told y'all that because I don't, I'm not telling, I don't tell y'all everything what's happened in my life and everything like that. So I told y'all that in this video because I don't want y'all to think that I don't like swimming and everything like that. I like swimming. Swimming is my second favorite sport. My first favorite sport of all time is soccer. I like soccer and I even played on a team, special needs team. It just for it just was for a day but few hours but I played on a special needs team but against another school but um anyway yeah I told y'all that so like comment subscribe